Hi guys, in this video we are going to see the stock light edition ROM for the Galaxy 7 2015 and this is very like real uh, equal to the stock edition of the ROMs like the um, uh, okay Opti ROM and but the icons and all are different the UI is different and the, it is great so let's look and it is made for gaming performance and great battery life so let's see what it has by installing it now let's put into the TWRP recovery mode pressing the home button uh, the volume up button and the power button and uh, after I boot logo remove your uh, hands okay this is old now many people know about it now let's go into settings and dim the brightness and uh, now we are going to YA people advance or Dalvi KHA data and system not the internal so that you can uh, if you don't have an SD card you can store your files on internal okay and okay going to internal storage and your stock light edition the side on voltage fix uh, so yes for Indian users we have the voltage fix too and by path 1199 999 I don't know about it so create uh, voltage fixed and uh, stock light edition is like the speed fusion remix so you will get better battery and not like the launch and everything the UI is totally different yeah the samsung touch switch with asset icons and all so great looking rom so for those who need performance and all you will use this thing so let's wait till we uh, get this finished Yes, there is more noisy this area is and we can you can hear the vehicle sounds and all sorry for that okay let's go here so okay booty match patcher this is going now to end matching an NIT in it what are these files I don't know now it's flashing boot image flashing the kernel Okay, first reboot may take time. Yes, we get this in every ROM because it's a new ROM. It's a new my thing. Now everything is flashed. Voltage fix to now reboot system. We get that new boot logo and let's see the boot animation. Okay, the stock Samsung boot animation. You can see this is slow that means it's just shock samsung boot animation so yes let's see what is inside after this for boots app and uh, the rom has booted up as you can now see and this is the ui you get a simple ui and the stock ui too so this is also simple ui editor very good uh, to develop all these settings ui is also greatly edited uh, to look different so yeah the asset icons and very colorful icons not like this similar icons like yellow color orange color these are this uh okay internet is the latest version let's go to the camera and see it's a fully stock camera you can see this modes and only four modes so yes this is the fully stock camera nothing uh, and we also do not have the uh, multi window mode you can do build prop editing and uh, get the multi window mode so in this settings we do not get anything let's see the ram usage let's clear the ram and everything it will provide more than uh, let's see okay so hopefully we get a 488 mb ram free and uh, okay in the background it is increasing let's see can clear all apps now we can get the real mp so 
so he has 493 MB free out of uh, 1.5 GB in with some and here is calculator working so this is stock and all those new apps are also working okay new game launcher and it's so fast like you can see accidentally some apps opened Samsung notes which is working too and the DPI is set to 320 okay Samsung notes is not working I think the latest version has some problems with our J7 this is the clock, smart manager with new icon, calendar I can show you the gallery but same stock you have gallery contacts, gallery because uh, my sister's data is in here going to settings nothing new we can get this ok privacy and everything home screen advanced features we get the games like the game tools game launcher quick launch camera by pressing the home key twice ok it's a normal uh, thing uh, one handed operation uh, floating messages also here yeah, but settings are stopping so i think it doesn't work and the ui is really going uh, similar to the crazy UX but modded ui so uh, this was the review for the uh, rom let's go to check the camera here is the camera as a stock camera it should be working with everything fine but i don't know what i'm having focus problems with uh, okay now it's focusing so great camera is working good and front flash as you can see it is stock so it's working only game tuner we get the latest version so for gamers this is mean you can train your galaxy not train like uh, optimize it in a great way for gaming and this is the ui good ui notices tutorial and here's the game tuner set to non game apps too i think modes you get the maximum power saving smart mode custom you can set in 50 60 fps okay so for faster gaming you can set to death mode so this is the review of the uh, stock light edition rom for the galaxy j7 2015 and this is uh, very awesome let's look about how the boost edition rom is boost light edition so this was the review for of mine for the j7 2015 stock light edition if you like this video press the like button if you don't like this video dislike the video and also post uh, the things about what you don't like or what i need to improve in the f and the feedback down in the description uh, in the comment section and subscribe for more videos and yes comment down below for more stuff uh, if you want any more videos I, okay i already have nine videos to shoot but still if you want some videos you can add to my list so it will increase and also about this videos you can ask about the help and queries so thank you for watching and goodbye we'll see you in the next video bye